Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a get ready with me, so if you want to see how to get this look, then keep on watching. Here I'm taking my Clinique toner and on a cotton round, I will apply this all over my face. Now taking my all over acne blemish treatment and putting this all over my face. Then taking my Clinique gel and using this as my daily moisturizer. This is perfect for anyone with oily skin just because it hydrates without leaving an oily residue on your face. Now taking my L'Oreal Lumi Magic Primer. This is perfect for anyone who wants a nice dewy glowy base underneath their foundation. I personally love to use it underneath my matte foundations. Now I'm taking my China Doll Eyeliner from Napoleon in Teo and I'm just going to use this to outline my eyebrows and also fill them in with this. I went with quite a bold eyebrow for this look. Now I'm taking my Soft Ochre Paint Pot by MAC and using this to carve out my eyebrows. I also like to use this as an eyeshadow base and I always blend it out with my finger. Now I'm going to take my Nude U palette by Napoleon and taking these two shades I'm going to use them to set the cream eyeshadow and use it as my eyeshadow base. Now from my Warm Neutral palette from MAC I'm going to take Saddle and use this as my transition shade. This is a beautiful shade that you want to build gradually and blending is the key with this smoky look. Just keep on blending till you can't blend no more. Now taking my Chi Chi Glamorous Bronze Palette and taking the really coppery orangey shade and just applying this all over my lid. You want to ever so slightly blend this into the crease colour. And don't forget to blend! Now taking a L'Oreal pigment in Unshamed and I'm just going to pack this on with a flat shader brush and build this colour up until it's the intensity that I like and constantly blending in that shade to the crease as well. Next I'm taking Napoleon's Colour Disc in Tawny Temperous and I'm going to smoke this into the crease just to deepen it up a bit and then I will go on to foundation. So I'm taking my Inflammable Matte 24 Hour Foundation in shade 22 Radiant Beige and I'm going to put this on my forehead and blend it in and then on my cheek and blend that in and on the other cheek, nose, chin and neck. Now I'm taking my Double Wear Concealer in 08 Warm Light Medium and applying this under my eyes, bridge of my nose, a little bit on my forehead and on my chin. I always prefer to blend out my concealer with a sponge or even your fingers work perfectly fine as well because they're warm. Now I'm taking my Kryolan Anti Shine Powder for the face and body and I am going to use this to set the concealer that I just applied to my face. I'm going to bake the face. Then I'm going to set my foundation with Golden Sand Look G4 from Napoleon in the camera finish and apply this all over those areas I put the foundation and then taking my Smashbox contour palette and I'm going to take the contour shade and use this to carve out my cheekbones. I'll also apply some on the perimeter of my forehead as well. Contouring is one of my favourite things to do. Then I'm taking the yellowy lighter shade and using this to dust away the powder we put under our eyes to set the concealer. Now I'm taking my Bronze Patrol by Napoleon and I'm going to apply this on my cheeks to give a bit of a glow and then I'll take Nars Laguna Bronzer to give myself more of a bronzy colour. So I've got the glow and now I want more of the bronze colour. Next I'm taking my Blush Patrol by Napoleon and I'm going to use this as my blush. This is a beautiful colour. And 
and blend that out. Now taking soft and gentle mineralized skin finish from MAC and I love to use this for highlighting so I apply on the highest points of my cheekbones, on the bridge of my nose, just above the arch of my eyebrow and I love to put it on my cupid's bow and also the tip of my nose as well. Now I'm going to curl my lashes because why not? And then taking one of my all-time favourite mascaras from Essence, it's Lash Princess and I'm going to give my lashes a pretty decent coat of this. This mascara is thebomb.com guys, you all need to get around it, it's amazing. Next I'm taking my Cappuccino Lip Liner in 047 from Rimmel. And I'm going to use this to outline my lips. This is new to me, this shade, and I think it looks awesome. And it's just giving me that little stepping stone out of autumn because I'm obsessed with autumn lip colours. So it's still quite dark, but it's a brown dark, not a red dark. So, you know, we're getting there. And I actually love using lip liners as my whole lip colour. So that's exactly what I did today was just use this lip liner and set it with Max Fix Plus and this is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate the support. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I hopefully will see you guys in my next video. Thank you for watching, bye bye!